Welcome to a short video for V-Motion between the V-Centers. So here are a few requirements for V-Motion. So the source and the destination V-Center instance and the ESXi host must be running version 6.0 or later. Both vCenter server instance must be in enhanced link mode and must be in the same vCenter single sign on domain so that the source vCenter can authenticate to the destination vCenter. Both vCenter server instance must be the time synchronized with each other for the correct vCenter single sign on token verification. For migration of compute resource only, both vCenter instance must be connected to the shared virtual machine storage. So guys, one point which we need to consider is the enhanced link mode. The two vCenter which we are trying to migrate between them should be in enhanced link mode. So the current infra which I am using look like this. I am having a platform service controller and two vCenters connected to the same platform service controller. That means my both the vCenters are authenticated to the same single sign-on. So let's go and see the demo. So here we have two vCenters vCenter 01 and vCenter 02 and I'm trying to migrate VM test VM from vCenter 01 to vCenter 02 so let's migrate change both compute resource and storage I'm just selecting the compute resource resource first I'm going to select the different vCenter that is 02 data center cluster ESX host it should succeed yes storage next folder so guys uh, yeah, you will get a short warning that it is in a different VLAN so just ignore that because you have to change the VLAN when it's got migrated or you can change there finish and let's see in the tasks so our task is complete now VM is now in vCenter 02 so this is the vMotion across the two different vCenters. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching the video.